98 achievements, one save. This is Achievement Chaser. Hey guys, it's Alex here, and I'm back with Achievement Chaser for episode 37 now uh, with Salgueros, um, and we're taking on Braga today. I've decided to to, uh, to uh, record this one, uh, the semi-final of our Portuguese League Cup journey. With whoever wins this faces Porto in the final, so. Even if we do win, it might be a challenge, and I think the game will be in three days. So if we w we do get through, we'll do a double live com, and we'll be here for the for the uh, f our first ever final. But we just have to get past Braga first. Um, we do have a, had a few games uh, in the meantime. Uh, after our sort of devastating defeat to Porto, we did beat Santa Clara four 0 um, who are towards the bottom of the league. This is a second-grade team as well, so it's quite good. This We won 4-0 on Enrique with the first goal here. Morante on the ball. And the animations don't seem to be working as they slide around. Um, but he gets the first there with the header. Uh, he gets his second and our second in the second half. Uh, oh, they're starting to move it. They're moving a bit better now. Morante on the ball. Plays into Enrique. Great little strike there. The keeper really should have done better. Um to make it 2-0 uh, and then uh, Yario with his first goal actually of for us uh, he's been basically a backup right winger um, but he's very good and a very good strike for him I feel bad for him because I think just Hill is so good uh, that Yario hasn't been playing and then uh, Dupois uh, or I don't I, this is not the correct way of pronouncing it but Dupois I don't know I'm saying it Dupois <laughs> um, but I've actually clicked on him rather than uh, the goal, which is why we're loading up his profile. Um, so we just have to wait for that to load. Um, <laughs> uh, but he gets off fourth. It was a very good game, to be fair. Um, our league sort of form has still been good apart from that Porsche game. We really are on course for Europe at some point, which is a bit mental in our first season. There has been a new hotfix as well, which should improve fullback ratings. Costina getting a 7.8 there, which is pretty good. Uh, I think he probably did get a couple of assists. Um, but the, the game really doesn't like it when you when you click on something that has to take you somewhere else. I'd like, it, it's mental. I, I must have to upgrade my PC. Like, a significant, a significant amount. But the thing is, though, the FM is supposed to be played on laptops too. Um, it it really has decided it doesn't want to play it. Are we going to... There we go. The little French boy. Um, <laughs> and we're back into the game quickly. There we go. Here, here's, here's his goal, finally. Um, in the 79th minute. Nedra on the ball into Ronaldo. Uh, into Pinto. Back to Enrique. Great little passing play by us. And Dupois uh, gets our fourth... Okay, uh, then we had a double header against Estoril, first in the sixth round of the cup, and then in the league. We won both games away, which is very good. Um, we've just got a cartwheel, and we, we've won the uh, cup game 2 0. Venderino with his first goal for the club um, from a little, uh, from a cor uh, corner, a free kick, getting ahead of that, his first goal, which is pretty good. And then Cravo in the 14th minute, getting our second, and that was pretty much the game. Uh, Morante on the ball here. Gets plays it back to Barbe. I think I don't know why they take it out. A bit of his name there, Cravo. Crafo. What's what is going on with this game at the moment? Um, but we get through in the cup there, so we've got to the semis as well of the cup. We got a semi final um, in the Portuguese cup to look forward to as well. These are the teams we're going to play. Uh, we got Familiciao. Porto, obviously, Forense and us. So hopefully we get one of Familiciao and Forense to get to the final. Um, but we'll have to see. We'll probably just get Porto. Uh, and then we play them in the league. Uh, we beat them 2-1 here as well. It could have been 2-0, but they scored in the 94th minute. Uh, did take a lot longer to break them down, though. Uh, but Enrique got our first in the 74th minute. Um, or the 71st. Enrique there with a great little uh, strike there um, from a Pinto cross. And then uh, Hill got actually what seemed to be the winning goal in the 83rd minute. Um, Enrique plays it across into Hill. I think, oh, no, Tellez played it across to Hill. And he's there at the back post for 2-0. And then 94th minute, 2-1. But today we take on Braga, which is a bit mental. Um, let's try and get revenge on them for our last meeting. We did dominate them last time, but they scored a, a free kick. 
um, a goal from a free kick and that was it so here's the team selection for today we actually did sign a goalkeeper um, on loan I forgot to mention that um, let's, I'll show you him when we get into it oh this is interesting they're saying a bit more so we got Gaspar on loan from uh, Sporting oh is it going to take ages to load up his profile why did I click on him there we go Vasco Gaspar uh, we've signed him on loan from uh, Sporting we could actually sign him because uh, Lucas Gaspar was terminated loan so we only have one loan from Sporting at the moment hasn't done too bad played two games uh, well three games actually only conceded one with two clean sheets so hopefully we can keep that form up but this is the team we're going to go with Gaspar and goal Costina um, oh yeah this is a really really bad we've we've also loaned Allsop this Carl Allsop from Sheffield Wednesday um, and thank god we did because basically um, Luis Silva's and Ibrahima Kamara's loans have been terminated by uh, their parent clubs because we weren't playing them. But this is the game, just the game before this, is when uh, both Venderino and Faustina have got too many yellows, so they're ineligible for this game. So we're playing Allsop on his debut and Ramon at centre-back. Uh, tell us on the left. So it's a very, very uh, sort of... Um, hack job centre-back partnership they're both rated very highly but I don't feel like they're going to play too well so this is a we're a bit up against it really here of, of course this is the game they get sort of um, suspended for uh, Tellers left back Nedra and Morante centre mids they've got a partnership there which is pretty good Hill on the right Krav on the left Kamara and then Pinto so it's a bit where if we win this it'll be amazing Carl also getting his first league debut in the semi-final of the Portuguese League Cup which is a bit mental um, I just this is our team gets so many yellows I don't know what it is I don't know if it's the if it's the uh if it's the tactics, but we get so, so many yellows during during uh, the season, which I don't know. I don't I don't mind as much because then there's actually not many sendings off. We get a lot of yellows, but we don't get many reds, um, which is interesting. But it does cause problems like this, where both of your centre-backs are out of a really big gap because it doesn't. Even, it applies all just domestically. Um, so even if you get them in the league, you get them in the next cup game, you miss them. So here's their team. Um, let's. I think we're playing at the Estadio de Luis again. Um, but here we go. Okay, get all of them sorted. I think we'll drop back f deeper again. Um, Especially with this new back line. I don't think... I don't, how fast is Allsop? Pace 13. Ramon. I don't think he's the fastest either. 12. So, yeah. We'll drop the, drop the back line. There we go. Um, there we go. Match preview. Kick off. And I'll skip this. Okay. And then we'll go into 2D again. Oh. I haven't paused it. 2D. There we go. Okay. Let's see if we can win our first semi-final. But we've, we've, this is the best chance yet because we're playing Braga. They're probably the weakest semi-final team we've played yet because we played Porto and Benfica in semi-finals so far. Um, but we've got the ball here. Morante on the edge of the box. Plays into Krav, into Pinto. Good play. Tellez is there. Oh, and he's, of course, it's just, just wide. If it had fallen to anyone else, I might have put it on scoring. But Tellez, the left back, probably not the best there to be shooting from uh, that angle. But we've started off well. We're dominating the game, which is good. Oh, Ronaldo's injured already. Um, he wants to come off. It's a bruised foot. Let's just keep him on for a little bit longer. Demand a little more from the boys. He's doing okay. I think we'll take him off at half time. Morante's looking tired. Bruised thigh. Everyone's getting injured in this game. Tellers, though, throws the ball. And Ronaldo there. The injured man. He shoots. It's blocked. And it's cleared. And they might count here. Fabio Martins on the ball. Plays it through. Can the, yes, Gaspar gets to it. Thank God. They haven't had much of the game at all, but I really wouldn't want them to get a goal here just before half time as well. Gaspar plays it out short to Ramon. Back to Gaspar. Very, very riskily there. They've got an injured player too. The highlight continues. They've got the ball back. Plays it long. Martinez is through. Oh, and he scores. 1 0 Braga. How was that? We literally just gave them the ball. And. After we've dominated the half, they're 1-0 up. Really, really poor play there. Just, oh, long ball, not marked at all by both centre-backs. And he's put, and Gaspar, terrible goalkeeping. And we're 1-0 down in the first half. Very poor from us. 
it's going to be a similar situation, I think. Um, show me something else in the la next half. We're going to have to sub Ronaldo off for Moha. And let's come on, lads. We need to go for it now. They've made a substitution too. Um, who's come off? Their right winger, but their left back's still injured. Who's still on? So let's go for it, lads. Come on. They haven't had any of the game, and we just we just let them score that. We really could have got that early goal, and we would be in much better position now. But nothing's happening in this half. We're going to move to attacking. 65. Okay, we've got a chance, thankfully. <laughs> okay, Costina into Moha. Going to try and turn the corner. Plays it back to Nedra. Into Costina. Go on, get into a good position. Hill's there. Go on, Hill. Oh, he shoots it straight at the keeper. Oh, terrible, terrible by him. He really should have played it off to Pinto, maybe. Tellers wins it back. Morante wins it again, but loses again. And they might have another chance here. Mendes into Tongia. Berisha. Plays it out wide to Pereira. The new substitute, Manafa, on the ball. Are they going to get a second here? Tongia, can we win it back? Mendes, come on, lads. We need to push forward a bit. Fabio Martins again on the ball into Martinez. Mendes again, Martinez. Oh, Berisha and Gaspar puts it over. Oh, come on, lads. We really should be doing better in this game. We should have a goal. Martins puts a cross in. Allsop clears. But 10 shots, 3 on target. We really haven't been doing well there. Okay. Um, demand a little more from the team. We've got 15 minutes to go and nothing's happening. Why Why do we have more chances in the second half, in the first half, when we weren't even playing that well? Um, okay, Enrique's coming on for Cravo. Come on, lads. We need to push forward. Nothing happening. We have to go very attacking. Is it going to be another <laughs> semi-final heartbreak where they literally just score one? And we can't do anything. We have an off day again. It looks like it. Unless there's a one more chance. They've got the ball. But can we win it back? Mendes to Colo. Can we? Come on. We need to win this. We need to win it. Brescia. Colo again. Morante. Yes. Hill wins it back. Plays it to Costina. Come on, lads. Costina goes long. Pinto. He's one on one. Oh, he's just shot at the keeper. Why? He's lit. We've just had both our major chances and they shoot literally down the keeper's throat oh for god's sake again semi-final heartbreak it looks like for us because it just seems that they can't perform in the semi-finals anymore that sucks oh sub miguel louise on but i don't think we're going to get to that point Pereira puts the ball in ramon clears they get the ball back again Oh it's, oh, it's so unfortunate. We really should have won this. Manafa plays it in. Costina clears. Barisha's on the ball now. Can we win it back? Oh, Moha should have been there. Costina wins it. Is there one more chance or is it the end of the highlight here? Costina, Ramon plays it long. Pinto, oh, he loses it again. And Hill just stands there and watches as they play the ball around him. And that's it. Oh, that really sucks. Another semi-final loss. I'm turning into bloody Solskjaer, losing all these semis. But that was the one we should have won. So I can't believe it. Those those chances we had, Hill and Pinto just shooting directly at the keeper. Oh, really unfortunate there. Because we played so much better. We really deserve to win that. Or at least go into extra time. And we can't continue now. Very interesting. Um, oh, we're, we're, we're a bit frozen again, unfortunately. But I guess we'll come back for the next semi-finals. We don't know who we're going to get yet. Uh, I think that's getting drawn on the 25th. Um, hopefully, it's not Porto. So we actually have a chance of getting to a final. Um, but we'll have to see. Um, there we go. Ronaldo Kamara injured for one to three days. Yeah. So the final is on the 25th. Um, 193k, not the worst. Yeah, that's the, I think the date for it. But yeah, um, I will be back for the semi-finals of the Portuguese Cup, which is in a few games. We've got four games in between. So unfortunate there. But yeah, uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, it's been Alex, and I'll see you guys next time.